It's Monday, May 13th, 2013. Tomorrow's my birthday, I just remembered. And let's talk about what happened this weekend over at xdadevelopers.com. <laughs> This episode of XDA Developer TV is brought to you by the XDA DevCon. Join us August 9th through 11th in Miami, Florida, a conference for developers by developers. More information available at www.xda-devcon.com. Hello again, guys. I am back from vacation. So glad to see you. Hopefully I'm a little bit less pale, but probably not. But enough formalities. Let's get on with the news. The Sony Xperia Tablet S has been on the market for a while now. Honestly, I've looked at it a little bit myself because it's a really interesting Tegra-based device. Device. And as it turns out, it's running Android version 4.1.1 at this point via an over-the-air update, but it was not able to be rooted up to this point. Again, until now. XDA4 member XX Lifts Up XX discovered a very sneaky way to make this happen by way of noticing that the Xperia Tablet S uses the exact same kernel that the Asus Transformer uses, which uses the exact same root method as a bunch of other devices, including the new Galaxy S4 root, which is Moto Chopper done by DJR Bliss. So essentially, this one exploit is being used everywhere. Now, there are still some potential quirks in using this vulnerability if you are interested in exploiting it. Do make sure to read through the forum thread to get all of the specifics. And I can tell you, if I ever get my hands on this device, I will definitely be attempting that myself. I don't think I've got my hands on a device yet that Moto Chopper does anything to, so I haven't really taken the time to learn more about it and actually try it yet. So will be very cool if I do get that opportunity. Fingers crossed. Moving right along to some news that I will never ever use. Facebook Home has been out for a little while now. A lot of people have tried it out. Some people love it. Some people hate it. Some people just don't care. But for those people who do not want to jump through all the hoops of getting it installed, going through all the individual package management, things like that, and keeping it up to date after the fact, XDA forum member Rukkukkuk, who has done some other exposed framework mods such as Xtheme Engine, has created another exposed mod that will allow you to install and use the Facebook Home stuff on your device. So as long as you can install the exposed framework, that's what you're going to have to have. You can put this mod on top of it, then you can do all the Facebook stuff you want to do on top of Android, if that's your thing. And I'm going to say it again, in case you've forgotten it in the last 30 seconds that I've probably been talking here, make sure to read the forum thread for all the details, all the caveats, things like that. And actually, thankfully, it was a bit of a short weekend. There were a couple of other stories I was going to talk about, but those are apparently not on the portal anymore, or they've been pulled down, or they've been changed or something. So let's just talk about the XDA Developer TV stuff. Jace put out two other videos on XDA Developer TV this weekend. The first one was an app development series video talking about testing your application, which is extraordinarily important. Do make sure to check out that video. The second one, another video in his app development series asking the question, is software development right for you? It shows off another interview and it talks about whether or not you should go into software development. And also goes into why some of these developers that he's interviewed actually got into development in the first place to make sure your motivation is in the right place. But anyway, it's actually Thursday night at about 11 something and I've still got to edit and upload this video and I've been going since 6 a.m. because that's when I got off the cruise ship. So I'm going to go ahead and end this. As always, thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to hit that like button if you like this video and subscribe to receive our content as soon as it becomes available. But anyway, again, thank you so much for watching. Do appreciate it. And I will see you again on Friday.